Hi everyone and welcome to Smart Alex Coaching. We offer mathematics tutoring for primary and high school students, both online and face-to-face. -face. This video is a continuation from last video where we introduced the radiant measure. In this video, we will look at how to calculate arc length, area of sector and area of segment of a circle when the angle is given in radians. Recall that the radiant unit is defined as the ratio of the arc length to the radius. Theta is equal to L divided by R. We can rearrange this equation to make L the subject, and that's going to give us arc length L is equal to R times theta. Suppose I would like to calculate the arc length L given the radius is 5 and the angle theta is pi on 3. This is what it looks like on the diagram. This length here, L, is what I'm interested in. I can use the formula L is equal to R theta, and substituting values of R and theta into the equation, I'll get 5 times pi over 3, which simplifies to just 5 pi over 3 units. So the arc length is 5 pi divided by 3 units. Let's look at how to find the area of sector of a circle. When we're looking for area of the sector, what we're looking for is a fraction of the whole circle itself. The area of the whole circle is pi r squared. The fraction of the circle is given by theta over 2 pi. I multiply these two terms together, cancelling out the pi. The, this reduces to a half r squared t, theta. So this is the formula for area of a sector, A is equal to half R squared theta. Suppose I would like to calculate the area of sector A, given that R is 5 and theta is pi on 3. R is 5, theta is pi on 3. And this is the area I'm looking at. I simply substitute into the formula A is equal to a half R squared theta, which is a half times 5 squared times pi on 3. This is going to simplify to just 25 pi over 6 units square. So the area of the sector is 25 pi divided by 6 units square. Let's look at how to find area of a segment. To find area of the segment, we work out the area of the sector and we take away the area of the triangle. So the area of the segment is equal to area of sector, take away area of the triangle. From the previous slide, we know that the area of the sector is a half r squared theta. The area of the triangle is going to be a half r squared sine theta. We can factorize out this expression, taking out a half r squared, and we're going to have theta minus sine theta in the bracket. So the area of the segment A is given by half r squared multiplied by theta take away sine theta. Suppose I would like to calculate the segment area given that r is 5 and theta is pi on 3. This is what it looks like on the diagram. This shaded area here is a minor segment and this is the area I'm interested in obtaining. Using the formula a is equal to a half r squared theta minus sine theta, I'm going to get a half times 5 squared pi over 3 minus sine pi over 3. This is going to give us 25 over 2 pi over 3 minus root 3 over 2. So the area of the segment is simply 25 pi over 2 multiplied by pi over 3 minus root 3 over 2 units square. Thank you for watching this video and I hope that you like it. If you do like it, please consider subscribing and sharing. We'll be making more of these math videos. Until then, enjoy math and I'll see you next time.